don't know how many pops of dis there are, which is why I'm holding off, because I want to gene mod them all into delicious food. But that takes a while. You understand. Three hundred days, three hundred days, three hundred days, hey, 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 hey. You're just sending them and bombarding them, right? It's another habitat. What? Are you guys just... What is this? Alright. Fine. I guess. Oh, there's a pirate fleet. Neat. Alright, look. So you're done. Can you just... Go here. Can you just go and do everything real quick, Rancorous? Does the pirate fleet actually oh, kind of attack. cut them into our what? <sighs> oh, they're just trying to fly away. That's just not happening. Construction is complete. Anyway, you're being built. Don't want to build up. Yeah, you know what? Got that one here. Our construction is complete. We can upgrade another starport and get another gateway set up as well. Fine. In Arcturus, Mengsk, get us a gateway all the way over here. There we go. You know, I was trying to basically waste my energy, but I can just see that that's not feasible. It's really hard to waste something you have in such an extreme excess. You see, this is why I'm just saving up resources. Progress. Oh yeah, since I have enough influence now, before I keep forgetting, I'm going to need to do this. We're going to be using the Rubricator. Our construction is complete. But ask, wait, why are we using the Rubricator? Well, the very, very, very last... The very last portion of the Mega Art installation, if I remember correctly, actually requires a hundred... a hundred minor artifacts. And so I need to use that four times to make up for the stuff I lost. And so I will. Great. Ah yes, you're actually on your way to just crush everything in the immediate vicinity. Neat. You actually- yeah, you took it, didn't you? Um, oh, you're landing. Alright. <laughs> Almost there. We need, like... Our construction is complete. Wait. What? Why are you here? How did you... Begun. What's your active construction queue? Enemy nest taken. Okay, just building a cruiser. Fine. All right. Take safe harbor, will you? Wait. Our construction However, since you're complete. all here, it's time to go destroy the Stellarite Devourer as we watch and wait for the rest of this place to be taken. How's that going, by the way? Okay, so we got, yeah, we're, we're conquering. So, I want you to head out here to Korgas and we'll eat that as well. With two fleets, we should be able to take it. 
with four fleets, five fleets, we should be able to eat this just easily. Again, I don't think the Stellarite Devourer actually drops anything, except just tossing out a bunch of stuff on all these planets and like flash converting a lot of these barren or molten worlds into Gaia worlds. I think. As the ISS combat vessel 200, no, it's a couple thousand and something enters the Rabinox system. It encounters something monstrous. Giant being radiating like a miniature star. Wrenchum's first thought this to be a binary star system. East exudes light waves, rapid pulses at an intense frequency like a fluorescent roar. Disconcerting. And the Stellarite Devourer awoke to being blasted by energy repeatedly. Oh god, its health is just being drained. It's firing back, definitely, but the swarm will not cease. Not for such a humongous prize. Can you imagine how the stuff of stars must taste? It must be glorious. The Stellarite Devourer has been vanquished. It remains curled up and evaporated, leaving only its digestive tract and the stellar matter it contains. Maybe there's some profound knowledge to be had from understanding this digestive system. Studying the corpse. Where's our science vessel? I want to know how close we are. Oh my goodness. Oh my. Oh my. Goodness. Get over here. We're just going to teleport you across. It's just going to be so much better than what you're attempting to do right now. And currently my nose is cur is rebelling against me, so I'm just going to let this run for a little bit, and hopefully something interesting happens. But if it doesn't, well... If it doesn't, I'll let you all know. Be right back. Unpause. We're going to go study the Stellarite Devourer's corpse. Too bad the other two that I'd be very interested in going after are hidden halfway across the galaxy. Otherwise... Okay, the only one I'm interested in actually is Greg. We still don't know what's in this system. But that should be rectified soon. How close are we? That's the art installation. How close are we to this? A hundred days. And then we get to see even more of the galaxy's little secrets. Little things hidden far, far and away. I guess this is an actual planet, right? Yes, so you'll bombard it into non-existence. Because guess what? I just can't be bothered to deal with all of that right now. God, this is going to take forever. Central processing make a singularity? I assume so. How many people are being processed into food? Let's find out. God, I'm selling these out in the internal market, but I know someone somewhere has just tried this for the first time, because I guarantee you some butchers are buying off of us considering we are so huge that their only way they could possibly live is by buying our products. All I can say is, yeah. What is going on? God, this is filthy. This is disgusting. All right, look, I'm gonna go through my species of my empire. We don't have Hadam anymore, but I know they still exist. Why do you have so many? What is up with you in subspecies? Alright, look. Apply template 
every species ever. It takes us a day to re like a month to research all of these. Get a little bit more, but just 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 cease cease to think. Get rid of all these subspecies and just let it eat you. Why? Is the invasion over? The invasion is over. All right. You all are going to sit right on top of Jube. Or Jub. The Sentry Array has finished being upgraded so we can actually see more of the galaxy. Oh, there's the mining station. It just doesn't show up for some reason. Our construction is complete. That's weird. We can get another relic from it. So I suppose that's nice. Complete sensor array, extend sensor range to cover the entire galaxy. I will do that for the low, low price of 100 energy per month, which is like nothing. Like, I'm fairly certain we can see everything already, but I'm just going to do the final upgrade just Our to complete it. Complete. Just for being a completionist person. Alright. I'm gonna just run through briefly. And stop at the planets on the way. Oh, and if this goes on long enough, will I just conquer them? Ah. <sighs> You can't just absorb them, that makes me sad. Negative a thousand, and they won't accept it. So their war exhaustion meet Our beats the demand of surrender. Complete. We've occupied most of it, and the relative navy strength. A plus fifty. I want a point though where the relative navy strength is so high that you don't just achieve war goals, you declare a war on them for absorption absorption, and then just immediately absorb them. Because what are they going to do to resist, really? To f stand up in open defiance of me? What, are they mad? Anyway, the next portion of the Mega Art installation will be done very soon. And I'll be very happy when that is. We're also working on getting our next batch of Unity. It's going to be a long, long while, and probably not really worth it. But the next edict I'd be willing to toss up would be probably Scientific Revolution. Simply because everything else is just not worth it. Except maybe Will to Power again. I now probably just do Will to Power, Architectural Renaissance, and... Scientific revolution in that order and just keep cycling through it to boost my techs out. The rest of this expanse. Oh yeah, and that means when we're done with this expanse, we could actually just move out and build on the rest of this territory, so we should should we so choose. I mean, who's gonna stop me? Not really anyone. Although, well, considering how slow this is, this is going to be a nightmare to edit. I might have, like, actually 30 minutes of usable footage. We can't. It's the arguably least bad out of all the options, simply because we are so long-lived. At this point, because the other negatives have a lot more... I don't care about claims. I don't need to make claims. Why would I claim anything? I would just eat. So, to explain why I've chosen the traits that I did, if I were to try to modify the template. So, we have Fertile, Robust, and Erudite. Those four traits put together do the following. Pop Growth Speed, plus 30%. Pop housing usage minus 10%, yada yada yada. 
slow learners cannot be removed because we are missing exactly one trait point. Now what we could replace it with is Repugnant, which drops amenities, which I'm reasonably certain we use amenities for maintenance strip depots and that's what we always need. And so amenities from those jobs are horrible. Housing usage would destroy our planets, as they currently stand. Why didn't I do sedentary? Hold on. Am I actually dumb? Do I have brain damage? Alright. How long is this going to take? Five months? Alright, let's do it. I don't care about sedentary. We can move everything over. There's no reason to care about costs. Oh, I actually have the I actually have the smallest brain I think I could ever possibly see. But yeah, since amenities is such a huge crisis problem that the good negative 2 traits that I would gladly use are basically impossible. Anyway, we're not going to be able to modify those people anymore, but yeah, it'll be fine. I can't believe I just didn't check for sedentary. Blah. Land armies in still haven. We are now ready to begin the colossal task of building the initial frame for a future ring world around the primary star of the Alderan system. Though the skeletal frame will be immense and hundreds of thousands of our finest engineers stand ready to begin the process of dismantling the system's planetary bodies into matter which can be used for the construction. Oh joy, did I screw up? Hold on, had a look at the ring world. Did I make a bad choice? Our construction I forgot delete. if it deleted the system, because if it deletes the system, I'll be kind of mad. Then again, it's not like I particularly care about it. Okay, I don't care. It produces some science and it produces some minerals. Now serve as a staging ground, resource depot, and living quarters for the hundreds of thousands of personnel involved with the Ring World's construction. Good, Hoyos. Let's begin the activation. Activate! At the end of the day, we'll be able to traverse our galaxy with blinding speed, and the Citadel will be done before it's that's finished, so that'll be nice. They've strayed from the hive mind. They'll be shot, eventually. God, we're making 10k food, and that's mostly because we're eating people. Yes. That's glorious. Enemy nests taken. Our special project is complete. The study of the Stellarite Devourer's shining remains leaves us perplexed and amazed. The star feasting being is in itself a miniature fusion furnace, harvesting solar matter to synthesize an energy source of its own. Since the body still contains significant amounts of solar matter from the star of the Rabinox system, the one it last fed from, it could be possible to extract the energy and reinvigorate the star, harvesting the corpse's heat for our own end could satisfy the energy needs in the short term, but doom the s system to an eternal ice age. Our situation log is updated. Alright, let's try and reignite the sun. Crack on map. Uh, 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 research the project in the system first, my good man, because we have an edict to pull out. We don't have an edict, we do have... Sorry. Oh, no, he's already doing it. Okay. Because we can reignite the system after scanning everything. We have adapted a species to suit our needs. I don't want to see this, I want to see what the sun looks like. Well, the sun seems like it's been reignited properly, so I don't see why there's a problem. Alright. 
you can pop over here and wait. We're just going to be sitting here bombing this planet into submission for a little while. Our ships can't make heads or tails of this thing. Is this Tenyaki Matriarch just humming flash through space? I think it is. <sighs> oh well. So we know that's the mining drone outpost. We know that's the dimen- Ooh! Did not realize the dimensional horror was just sitting here. Really, no sound effect with it? I guess that makes it all the more horrifying. Construction is complete. The worm that was, the worm that will be. The worm that wasn't. Ah yes, Arcturus, we can actually build the gateway there. Yeah, there's like three big things that I'm actually really interested in. Awaken my gateways. Jubba ba jubba ba. I mean, I can easily take it right now, but I'd rather take it with minimal casualties and probably not losing my general for the umpteenth time. <sighs> I template to all the worlds. Our situation log is updated. Modify species. It's gonna happen again, and this is gonna keep happening. But I'm just gonna keep reapplying this template until slow learners is bred out of our species. I should modify you and change the name. You are not Secundus. Multix Perfectus. Perhaps someday when all the species stop growing, and I really hope we never get to that point where all the planets stop growing, because that means they've just faffed about way too much. But when we hit that point, perhaps I might swap the name to all these people being multics. Wow! We have adapted our species to suit our needs. Cease and desist our situation log is updated. on this. I'm going to sit here until that number here hits zero and more don't keep getting born. We've been trying to babysit you, and so you stop growing the inferior breed, but you keep doing it. God, can you imagine if we go back to like our basic species? The system. Hello? What be this? Cluster shapes on the barren surface that could be buildings. Looking down. Oh, tell me this is gonna unlock an ex- like, uh, archaeology. Or arcology, or whatever. A dig site. A dig site is what I should call it, because I really want a dig site. Our construction is complete. I know I've lost many, many, many months of research to try to fix our pops. But we just can't help it. Pops keep getting born that shouldn't be. And so something is going wrong. The mega art installation should actually be done soon, or at least a part of it. 84 days. A request from the Commerce Guild. What? Hold on. Uh, 
the above Honden Commerce Guild claims to have uncovered intel suggesting that we're building a secret launch platform for weapons of mass destruction on our ring world. Requests our permission to inspect the site. Our military advisors have yet to confirm whether it's an honest mistake or something more sinister. Either way, we should handle this denied. You're not going to go to war with me. The last time you did that, I ate an entire one of your species. So much so... Actually, almost... Okay, no. There are some of them left. Some of them. We have adapted a species to suit our needs. Almost. We have... Just one, like, hopefully this is like the last batch. It's kind of like a reoccurring infection. You keep taking drugs purely to remove it, but it's just not working. And you keep trying to fix it, and you keep doing more and more of it, and it just never works. Alright, Judd, are you dead yet? Pre-sapience. How are your armies looking? You're at 600. Still too much for my tastes. 300 or less, or leave it. We have another gateway that's being built, right? It's right over here. Yeah. You're pretty close. It'll be a long, long time. I know that you're excited. I've been working on it while I'm at work because work is really slow. And also, funny story about my work, actually. Uh, today is the day I had learned that, once again, I got into a job where the boss quit. Not even two to three weeks into my onboarding. And I have a new boss already. And this is so stupendously common that I... Uh, I don't even know what to say. Like, the previous two jobs I've held, which one was another sales job, and one was effectively a telemarketing job. It's effectively telemarketing, but not actually telemarketing. One had my boss leave after being there for a couple months. Like, as I was leaving, they were also leaving. And Our the other one was basically a revolving door for all my co-workers and everyone who was higher than me. To the point where I was the one who was there the longest, with the exception of, like, upper management. It's a really bizarre phenomena related to me entering any career field. Is that anyone higher than me in there will just spontaneously disappear without any regard for anything that's going on. And I'm never able to figure out why. Is it just like complete coincidence? Or are people just like, yeah, this person's awful enough, I'll hire it on for giggles. Or something like that. Oh, unusual tectonics. Neat. And then we'll delete all of this stuff. The first stage of the mega art installation combined the difficulties of building a vast station with the complexities of organizing a museum and gallery on an unprecedented scale. Basic structure in place, the vault will be the top priority. Planned to be a marvel of security and stability, the vault will contain and protect the artistic wealth of the galaxy. Excellent. So we can finally move on with... That's a ring world. 
maturity. Wait. It just gives amenities? Oh, don't tell me I'm going to rebuild all my planets. Might have to. Okay, now I feel weirded out. We'll see. So when this reignites, I don't know what's going to happen. Project was a success. Submerging the stellar devourer's remains in the system star has stoked the flames of the solar furnace. The planets in the system are heating up, reverting to their past forms as their ecologies recover. One of them is a frozen world now revealed to a Gaia world, ready and ripe for colonization. Well. That's a lot of molten worlds. So... Why does it gain that? Because so far it doesn't look like it did. We'll build something there anyway. It's not the crisis. That's the Stellarite Devourer activating. We're still waiting for the Crisis, Zaurok. It's not my fault. I can't make RNG just decide to do something. I wish I could, but I can't. Ah, uh, maybe. It might be Crisis. I don't... I'm not familiar with the iconography of the game. Okay, so... You finished building. Does that mean you could actually hit and or target and kill? You did. No, you didn't. Alright. Fine. The joke is over and done with. We've bombed these people into submission for long enough. The gateway is now in place. It can be constructed. But that doesn't our matter. Land complete. our armies and put an end to this war. And start this gateway on to its process of going online. Sell all my food, sell all my minerals. Buy more crystals, buy more gems. That should officially end the war. Alright. Now the one problem is that no one can go home. Well, that's alright. If no one can go home, we can fix that. Sorry, we're working on fixing that. We're just waiting for the gateway to be finished. <laughs>